roll call for Space Transportation System 107, also known as Space Shuttle Columbia. Barry McCool. I am the father of Willie McCool. Willie McCool is my oldest son. We just hope that America will continue to realize the value of what Willie and his colleagues on STS-107 accomplished. All the experiments that they did that was recovered. It was a tremendously successful mission all the way down to 16 minutes from home. We get to walk the halls every day that Willie McCool walked. And that's a very special thing. At the Naval Academy, class of 83, he graduated number two out of 1,661 midshipmen. He wanted to come back and teach. His desire was, once my career is over in the Navy, I want to come back and I want to be a teacher. I want to pass down what I've learned to the next generation. This is our future, ladies and gentlemen, right here. To give you an idea how difficult it is to become an astronaut, Willie had to apply twice and go through the interview twice with uh, Buzz Aldrin and Jim Lovell and some of these other famous astronauts that were interviewing him. Commander Rick Husband, Colonel, U.S. Air Force. Rick Husband, he applied four times before he was accepted as an astronaut. So it's a very hard field to get into. Ready, aim, ah. <laughs> Don't forget what all the astronauts and all our military have given to this nation. They've given everything.